Alright guys, so uh, it is Friday and I got off work early, which is always great. Uh, we are on the way to the gym to do some bench press and it's going to be exciting because I get to try out these new mini gangsta wraps that uh, Silent Mike, uh, who's in, you know, he works with uh, Mark Bell over who makes Slingshot and uh, HowMuchYourBench.net, so they sent me over some gangsta wraps, mini gangsta wraps. Um, I'm not sure if he was trolling, but he's also trying to help me out because I do a smaller wrist. But uh, really excited to use these. Uh, I tried them on for overhead press, and I uh, really like the quality a lot better than what I have used in the gym. These uh, cheaper wrist wraps, you can definitely tell the quality as soon as you know you put the mofos on. So uh, not sure what I'm gonna try to get maybe like 240 for five by five again. We'll try to get it for actual sets, maybe even 245, depending if someone's there to help me lift off the bar. Um, other than that. It's Friday, so gonna have a good weekend, and I uh, hope everyone kills it in the gym after seeing this video. Gangsta regulation. Auto regulation, guys, why is it important? Why is auto regulatory training important? And uh, the answer to that, in my personal opinion, is going to be because, uh, you know, you need a plan. You can't always go into the gym and consecutively progress and progress and progress and progress. I mean, with bench press, you know, if you look back at my older footage, I've been, you know, floating between 225 and 240 since I've started back on barbell bench for, you know, two, two three months now. So it's like... Max, why isn't your bench going up, you know? And that's where auto-regulation comes in because, you know, it, it's it's based on how you feel each day. It's based um, on your programming, and you can't always progress, you know, on a linear path every single workout. Each workout is going to have a different feel. Each workout is going to have different progression. Um, you know, in my, in my previous video where I do the 225 pause reps, you would think that if I can get 225 for pause reps, then I damn sure better be able to get you know, 240 for five sets of five without pause. As you see here, wrapping up the mini gangsters, and I don't know if this was a, a little troll at me, because I am a mini person with mini legs and, uh, you know, a mini large deadlift. Ha ha! But, you know, he, he sent me these, these gangsta mini wraps, and I really, really appreciate that. I want to thank Silent Mike. I want to thank, you know, the whole team over there. Uh, you know, whoever decided... To, uh, to send me these things because they really were fantastic. I mean, they were significantly better than any other wrist wraps I've used. Now, I've only used maybe two or three different wrist wraps, but you, s but you know how you can just tell you can tell something the craftsmanship and the quality of something just by grabbing it. I mean, the Enzer belt. You go, we went from a Vale Valio Vallejo belt. You throw in your Enzer belt for the first time, and you're like, holy crap! I can feel the difference. That is how you feel with these wrist wraps, and you know the quality is uh, you know excellent. Um, I really enjoy the minis because, he, you know, I think the longer ones are, you know, the regular gangster apps are significantly longer if you watch Brandon Campbell's. Unfortunately, he did a great review on them, and, um, you know, they're really, really long. These are just your basic length. I think they're like 20 inches or something. I'll, I'll put a link down in the description. So it doesn't take a long time to um, necessarily put them on. But, you know, the point of this video is going to be, look at that, I keep whacking the damn side there but um you know auto regulation guys you know not every single workout you're gonna go in there and not every single workout you're gonna go in and you know progress sometimes you go backwards and it's not because you know it's not because you need deload it's not because you know whatever look at this look at this you know cinematic shot right here um you know it's just because you know different days are gonna feel differently different ways are gonna be stronger than others you know did you get the same amount of water did you get did you eat at the right time there's so many factors that go into your lifts that you can't always um, you know, if you have a bad workout, you can't always assume that your strength is going down. You know, I if I was doing 225 pause reps and here's 230 is rough for 5x5, five five, you know. Um, you know, for this, I guess, fourth or fifth set, whatever this is. Um, but, you, you know, get in the gym. Always progress. Always be looking towards, you know, your next workout. Always be planning your next workout. But, um, you know, auto-regulation is important because, um, you know, just like in, in life, your workouts will come and go, and good workouts will come, bad workouts will come. And, uh, you know, sometimes you just got to just just roll with the punches, guys. Roll with the, uh, go with the flow, and, um, you know, just enjoy your lifting career. You know, it's not, you're not going to go backwards significantly because you have one bad bench press workout. You're not going to go backwards because, uh, you know, you couldn't get 245 by 5 every single set. You know, I, I've been trying to hit 245 for 5x5 five for a while now, and I still can't manage it. I'm still fluctuating between you know 225 and 240 
But uh, you know, auto regulation is important because it's it's going to help you um, because you should always be kind of planning out your workouts. You should be you know looking ahead and you should be focusing on your next lift. Um, just wanted to wrap up this video by saying thank you to Gangsta Raps, Mark Bell, the whole um, you know crew over there at HowMuchYouBench.net, which I'm gonna link in the description. Get these mini gangsta raps if you're a mini gangsta, cause damn, it feels good to be a mini gangsta, guys. Ab workout finishing up. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and until next time, I will see you later.